I am Jeff Brantley with the Indiana Chamber of Commerce. Election Day in Indiana is about two weeks away, and we are tracking races across Indiana that matter for our state's future. This is the first race, first election after redistricting, when new legislative districts are drawn, new territory, new candidates, new opportunities, and new threats. And we're very engaged as the Indiana Chamber in supporting thoughtful pro-business candidates with a vision for Indiana because we are determined to see Indiana move forward, and that takes leadership, starting with the General Assembly. So what are we seeing out there on the hinterlands? Um, the fight for the General Assembly, the fight for Indiana politics right now is largely in the suburbs. That's where the greatest demographic and political alignment shifts are happening. But we're also seeing interesting things like that are happening, for instance, in the 1st Congressional District, where former Democrats, working class, and even union members are now realigning as Republicans, and higher educated, higher income suburban voters are moving more towards Democrats. These demographic, demographic and political shifts have a big impact on Indiana, and your Indiana Chamber is tracking that, and there are opportunities and threats that come from that. So what does this mean for you? What is Indiana's future and what can you do about it? Come out and vote on November 8th or vote early. Go to indianavoters.com and there you can look up information on your voter registration, where you can vote and how you can vote early. So please come out and vote on election day and take a stand for Indiana's future. Thank you.